Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Where we spoke with kindness and love, so make sure to subscribe. creep anyways in today's video well, i'm gonna be showing you guys how i edit my thumbnails on my phone so yeah guys i hope you guys enjoy the video make sure to subscribe down below because i'm trying to hit 1k and i'm about to hit three, uh four, 540 subscribers so that's amazing i'm sorry for the like, pale on this video but i don't know what i just said but for iphone users i recommend to use porch mode instead of all these other steps so yeah let's get started okay guys so the thumbnail um this is the first row of apps i use so the first row of apps i use so take your picture obviously go to eraser um, sound effects, and then you want to go to camera roll well, like for the video that you, the picture they did go to erase and i just target area because it erases things really well, so I'm gonna erase it in the background. Hey, boo! Busted. Busted. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you close my door, please? <laughs> so I'm done, people. So now we're going to save it. Okay. And now I'm going to go to Pix Art. So I'm going to press the plus and then do the video that is not blur that is not erased. So I'm going to press effects. And then go to blur and then you want to press add photo and then do that do the picture that is erased and i'm gonna put this over like the picture that i don't want to be like blurred so like i don't know how i'm supposed to explain this but just do it how i'm doing it so yeah now i'm gonna go to sticker and press the stars i've already used it but just look up like the stars adjust and I'm just going to do like do that and make it white. So I'm going to press the erase button. I'm just going to do it where it's on my face or like my hand or my phone. So I'm going to go press the plus and then press plus for sticker and do the same thing. So yeah, I'm really sorry to look pale. I don't like it. So yeah, I'm gonna save it and then I'm gonna go to Fonto. I'm gonna show you guys how to download font. So I'm gonna go to Chrome. I'm gonna look up duffmont.com, duffmont.com. Um, and basically what you can do is you can just look up different like fonts. You have to like, explore this, there's different categories. And, and you know, it's just amazing. So I'm gonna go to retro. Because I feel like that would have the most like aesthetic one. So I'm gonna do this one. I mean, you're gonna press download. You're gonna press download again. You have to have Fonto. Press open then. Fonto. Press install. I'm gonna go press the camera. Photo albums. I'm gonna do that one. I'm gonna press add text. Just click on the photo and it says add text. I'm gonna say what's on my font and I have all these different fonts. I'm gonna do bubblegum style. I like to do the stroke, get black and like make it like where you can easily see it. I'm gonna go to style and then press that the black and then press the middle A and it does that. So yeah. So I think I'm gonna make it smaller. Put it right there. Now I'm going to say thumbnail. So this is a thumbnail for this video. I'm just going to do a different font. I'm going to do the 
this one. And so I'm gonna swipe and it does curve. Not really curve. So yeah, now I'm gonna save it, press save image. And then you are going to go to YouTube studio to upload it. I'm gonna do a random private video. Press the pencil, press edit thumbnail, press custom thumbnail, and then do the video. Press select and then just press save. So yeah guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Comment below if this helped. If it did, I'm glad. Um, peace. <laughs>